Hello everyone. Today, in this video, you will learn how to cook Minoto Filipino style. Here are the ingredients you will need. One kilogram pork cut into cubes. Quarter kilogram pork liver cut into cubes. Four hot dogs cut diagonally. Two pieces carrots and two medium sized potato. One large fresh tomato. One piece fresh radish cut into cubes. One red bell pepper. One chopped onion. Three cloves minced garlic. Half fresh lime and four pieces dry bay leaves. Half cup raisins. One teaspoon brown sugar. Two tablespoons soy sauce. One tablespoon unsalted butter. Black pepper and salt. Here's the procedures you need to follow. Before you cook your minodo, you need to marinate your pork. First, pour only half the soy sauce onto the pork. And stir. Put a dash of salt and pepper. And mix well. Squeeze the lime. And mix thoroughly. And let the pork sit for one hour to marinate. Now that it's an hour, it's time to cook your manodo. The first step is you need to heat up your wok and make sure that it is hot on medium heat. Add the butter and move it around the frying pan. Let the butter melt. Now that the butter has melted, you can start to add your ingredients. Add the garlic and saute it. Saute the garlic until it becomes light brown. Add the onion. Add the marinated pork. Stir for a while and let it sit for 5 minutes. Add the tomato. Add the bay leaves. Make sure that your stove top is on medium heat. Do not put water because the tomato will make it juicy. Now that it's 15 minutes, you can add potato and carrots. Then let it sit for 5 minutes. After 5 minutes, add the radish. And stir. Add the liver. Add the sausage. 
and stir. Add the raisins. Add the sugar. Add the soy sauce. Add the black pepper. And stir. Let it sit for 5 minutes. Now that it's 5 minutes, add the red bell pepper. And stir. Stir for 1 minute and your menot dough is ready to serve. This recipe is called Mendodo in Filipino and in English it means stew pork with vegetables. It's already cooked so now you can put it into a serving dish. Mmm, your Minoto recipe is ready to serve and ready to eat. And it smells very good too. If you like the YouTube videos that I make for you guys, please subscribe to my YouTube channel, rate this video, comment on this video, and share this video with others. Also, if you'd like to make a cooking request, you may send a cooking request to my email address. It is within this video. Bye everybody, see you in the next video.